Hi lovely viewers, it's me again, your one and only Mtati Mpundu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and turn the bell icon to join the notification squad. Don't forget to like, share and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. Let me tell you, this is politics. You PN the one to run Zambia like church. And I was laughing at you. You guys don't know anything. I even laughed at the president the day he, he picked up his phone and called Eddie Galunga. I said, this one don't know politics. He's a businessman. Very soon he will know politics. And I thank God he's beginning to know politics now. Politicians, especially criminal politicians, they are like Satan. They don't change. If they have opportunity, they will kill a church today, as I'm talking to you. I have information. I was with, with PF. There is nothing that I don't know about PF. It's a criminal organization. If they have opportunity, they will kill him today. And this is the type of person that Edgar, uh, uh, HH speaks to. Hey, my brother, come for burial for... You think he... Let me tell you this. This is politics. This is not church. The sooner you realize it, the better. You must love everybody, but not work with everybody. If you have to succeed as a government, if you have to succeed as a political party, you must get rid of PF. And this begins with the ministries. I said it the other day, the president must set up a, 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 a committee that goes from ministry to ministry. Find out the reason why his ministers are comfortable working with PF. I have the information. I don't want to... When I start fighting them individually, it is going to affect my president. And I don't want to do anything that will affect my president. But I want to assure you that most of your ministers are corrupt. And they don't have the good of Zambians in mind. They have the good of their families and even PF in mind. That's why they have failed to appoint your people. The people that fought for the party are crying. There is a man that spoke to me from Luansha, President HH, I believe you know this man. This man sold his house and used almost 3 million kwacha to sponsor campaigns in Luansha. As I'm talking today, that man is homeless. He doesn't have money again. Why people like this are suffering? Why people like this have not even been remembered? Your, your, what do you call him? Your SG is going around bringing back criminals into the party. People that fought for the party, people that lost a lot of things. I know a lot of people that went to prisons. There is this young man, Azim uh, Motomela, uh, or what? There is even uh, Mobita Nawa. There is uh, many of the, even this musician, uh, 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 what is his name? This reggae musician uh, in Zambia, what is his name? Uh, not Peterson. The other, the other musician, those that went to Bush, youths that went to Bush to, 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 to campaign against PF. All these guys are not given anything. All these guys are not remembered. Your, your, your SG, UPND SG, the only thing he can do, go from all the bushes where criminals are hiding and bringing them into the party. The same food that the people of Zambia vomited, you are bringing them back and forcing that same food back in their, in their throat. And you think you are wise. And you think you are wiser. Going forward, election is going to be won through the youth. And those people that he's bringing don't have impact on the youth. What is what is uh, 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 what is uh, Charles Kakoma? What is he going to tell the youth? He doesn't have any influence. What is uh, all of them? All those guys that he's bringing, old people. I think those are his old friends, the people he drink with. Even the SG do not understand politics. Ah, uh, Marco Zulu. People like this that sacrifice their life. You remember what Campiongo did that day? Campiongo brought, brought armored cars. These children just wanted to, camp, to, to, to protest for free. And they were humiliated in their own land. All these people are not remembered. Then you go and start bringing in criminals to come and continue eating. 
eh, the minister of copper bed went it's not even a year in it's not even three or four months in the government in party you, you don't even have your own operating system as you can see now you don't even have your own operating system you are still operating with pf without sorting your house and making your house perfect, you go and start bringing in criminals, the people that were rejected by the people of Zambia. Eh? The same food that people of Zambia say we don't want, the same food they vomited. Your SG is going, including the vice president, a whole vice president, eh? going to receive a criminal. Who doesn't know who Kevin Sampa is? Eh? Who doesn't know that Kevin Sampa is a criminal? Is he not the one that sponsored the youths that wanted to kill you, HH? What is wrong with you people? Eh? You carry them and start bringing them to the party. When people that fought for the party are all hungry. The guy that sang the song that the president HH was using to, the song that brought revolution in Zambia. Anytime that song played, everywhere was shaking. I did not understand properly the language of Zambia, but the beat, the, 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 the voice of that guy brought a lot, he shook a lot of things. Those guys, you have not remembered them, you have not given them position in the party, you have not given them position in the mind, and then you go and start bringing in old people, the people that were rejected by the people of Zambia, and you call it growing the party. Eh? A whole vice president. Eh? Wasted. Oh, tell me that if if the if the if the 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 office of the vice president is just there to gallivant from here to here, it doesn't contribute anything to the to the country. You remove it because I don't see the reason why that we, we are a whole vice president. We abandon what is doing to go and receive a criminal. At the end of the day, has police not arrested him? for stealing over a million from a man. Are you not ashamed of yourself? The thieves that Zambian people rejected, those are the people that you are bringing back. You think you are wise. If they have influence, if Rashida, if Kevin Samba, if uh, Charles Kakoma, and all these criminals that you are bringing back to the party and they're abandoning the youth, if those guys are so influential, why didn't they win PF the election? It's like when you take over power, you become, you stop thinking properly. Once you take over power and start eating properly with 24 hours electricity, you forget where you are coming from. Eh? You totally forget where you are coming from. That is rubbish. You PND people are crying. They don't even have what to do i am in all the groups of upnd people i see how the youths are crying every day those that spent the, how about this young children NAC unit in luapula we are those days when you mention upnd they can stone you alive these guys plus uh, honorable mukuka kelvin mukuka those days if you mention upnd in those struggles they will kill you these guys sacrifice their life Eh? They sacrifice their life to go and composing a song and singing it on the street. They have not been remembered, and you go and bring in criminals to come and continue eating from where they stopped. That rubbish must stop. That's why I'm saying UPND leaders are not helping the president, including those that are advising the president. They are not helping the president at all. The president mean well for the people of Zambia. Is the best president anyone can ever think of. President Akaidechilema, I don't support rubbish. I don't support nonsense. When, once I tell you this is how it is, that's how it is. I'm telling you that the president mean well for the people of Zambia, but most of the people he has appointed are rubbish. Because if they are okay. If, like, especially his minister of youth and sports, a very useless, useless minister as we talk today. The most useless minister as we talk today. If I am to say, I would ask President, if he love that minister and uh, that other slayer king, uh, that slayer, if he love them so much, he must remove them from that, maybe put them in a uh, 
tourism where they will be dressing well, comb their head and take pictures and post. They bring somebody that understands the youths and put him in that ministry. This is the ministry that will make or break UPND. It's, it's a ministry that you don't need to play, play with. Ministry of youths and sports. The youths are the only thing. If you don't know, I want to tell you something so that you know it now. If you don't know, I want to tell you something. The campaign that PF is going to do in 2026 is a campaign of tribe. They will say, because these people are these people are minority, let us unite and take power from them. Mark my word, they are going to work with the chiefs. I've forgotten the name of that chief that Satan never wanted to make chief. I've forgotten his name, and the, and the HS supported him. That chief, I've forgotten his name. That tribe, tribal chief, the one that Cambuiri and, and his friends went to meet this week. I've forgotten his name. That chief and other chiefs are going to come together, together with PF government, to launch a tribal campaign in 2026 now hh how are you going to survive this majority of the youth in zambia hate tribalism they don't want to have anything to do with tribalism they believe in one zambia one nation yes Ch Ch chitumukulu is going to form a, a very serious alliance with pf and they will fight unbelievably in 2026 how are you going to stop this number one the youths do not like tribalism the youths say whether you're a tonga a member a lozi or from the eastern we are one zambia the youth understand the language of one zambia one nation but the elderly people in the rural area where these guys are going to concentrate do not understand these things. I'm telling you they are going to divide the nation. Get this thing from me. Now, for you to overcome them with their tribal campaign that they are going to start, you must take care of the youths. Make sure that the youths are happy. If the youths are happy, the youths will vote in number. If the youth do not vote in number, it's going to be a disaster. I'm telling you the gospel truth. They are going to organize very huge. Anytime when I say something, people can argue. You know, we can argue because in mouth we are equal. But I know myself. I know where I belong. I know that I am already in 2026. I've seen how it happened. Take my word serious. You need to bring in a youth minister that understands the youth, not slay king, and, the, uh, and, and, and a youth minister that understands a youth PS that understands the youth, not slay king. Take those slay kings out of that place. Take them to uh, uh, take those slay kings to maybe minister of tourism. Let them go there and showcase their 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 handsome. And they, they can dress very well. Let them go there and take picture. And they take care of those that places. Okay. But you see, this ministry of youths needs somebody. You have many people. Believe me, you have many people. You have somebody like Jito there. Jito can manage the ministry very, very well. Because he understands the youths. He can get to the youths. You have so many people after the other. Talking to the youth. Oh Talking to the youths. One after the other. And no, the youth, what do you want? Like that. Everything is okay. But the way that they can steal, they have been taught how to steal. And please, His Excellency, listen to my advice and make changes. UPND leaders. There is still time. You still have a lot of time to put this in order. Dissolve boards in the ministry. Dissolve the ministry. Flush out the 
you a, a pf people and bring in upnd people upnd is not a southern province but upnd is a party for all zambia in in upnd you find members you find easterners you find losses bring people that are capable from upnd and flush out the people from pf completely this must be done by the ministers and the pscs don't overburden the presidents i love you apart from politics you have listened you want to talk to me there is anything you want me to do for you my number is there send me a message on whatsapp plus two three four eight zero two zero nine four three five seven six plus two three four eight zero two zero nine four three five seven six in conclusion his excellency zambia is not an a church i know that you love god so much you love jesus so much you know if somebody can open your heart they can see that god is living in your heart but this is africa if you want to be a president in africa you must be strong everything will not be about god said god didn't say the president of rwanda came to zambia a few weeks ago and he was celebrated why was he celebrated he has achieved a lot in his country why did he achieve a lot in his country he created an environment that fitted his style of leadership his excellency in judiciary create your own people if you have the power to fire judges fire judges and bring in judges that understand your vision in acc create an environment that will suit your work every successful president in africa or in the world has people that understand his vision that support his vision working in all the ministries the late president magufili of uh, magufili or what was in tanzania he was a great leader why he created an environment that suited the style of leadership if you don't create it thinking that let's work we are all zambians let's work we are all children of god you you will suffer they will frustrate you until you cry get rid of if i'm if if i am going to tell you something eh? pf leaders and pf members of parliament they love money they are hungry if you have to take a bill into parliament and call them aside this is part of leadership this is africa my brother call them aside and talk to them nicely they will support the bill if it's possible i want your members to move in a motion in the parliament and scrap off concord constitutional court they, it must they remove it that is not helping the people of zambia it's, it's only helping criminals remember these are the same people that deceived the digalung that is eligible to stand these are his people if you cannot scrap it off retire those judges retire them you have the power as number one citizen retire them if it has to go through parliament if you take it there it will go through i know what i'm talking about take it change most of the constitution in your own eye edgar lungu was changing things anyhow he want to suit his style of leadership he was he not be 10 that was nearly going through if not by the grace of god so what will stop you from taking things there and change things all these guys chitotela uh, uh, this guy all these guys that have been acquitted pass a law that will revisit it so that they'll be brought back answer the query bring back what they stole and go to jail you have the power you can do it do it before it's too late the good the benefit the, the the better part of it is that the people of zambia are supporting you 
they, they love you so much. So anything you do at this time, we are going to clap our hands for you. This is DJ Mutati exclusive. Alright, that's all right for you today, lovely viewers. If you did enjoy the video, please don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below. Tell me what you think about the video you just watched in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you, lovely viewers. Once again, I go by the name of Mutatim Pondum. I love you, peace. I gotta go.